Oh, God, help me! Please, help me! Jessica! Ached for this moment. Ah! Scream all you like, my love. There's no one for miles around who can hear you. No one who is going to show up in the nick of time to rescue you. Why do you think I brought you all the way out here? <laughs> I realized in my last town that doing this in my office or a patient's home was getting too risky. I might have been caught, and I couldn't get caught now, could I? Then I would never have met you. Oh, careful, my sweet. I wouldn't want you to bruise your succulent skin. Oh, how I long to lick you. Ah! You'll like being licked, I promise you. Just like you'll like being bruised when it's me who does it. How about it, Jessica? Are you ready to rock and roll? Ah! Scream, my darling. It's sweet music to my ears. Now, what do you say we get rid of a few things, shall we? Don't. Please don't do this to me. No! 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 Oh, come now. You have no one to blame for this but yourself. Oh, God. You are so beautiful, Jessica. I want to feel you from the inside out. Oh. 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 Oh, my. Oh, you naughty little girl. Do Mommy and Daddy know the little princess isn't a virgin? <laughs> Oh, don't worry, my sweet. Your secret is safe with me. And when I've finished with you, they won't be able to tell the difference. <laughs> you poor, sick bastard. How do you sleep at night? Quite peacefully, now you mention it. And with peculiarly vivid dreams. Of raping young innocent girls? Oh, get over yourself. You don't think any of that actually happened, do you? What? I don't understand. I thought you said that I would tell you what you wanted to hear. And that was what you wanted to hear, wasn't it? You wanted the vicarious thrill of fucking a high school girl, so I gave it to you. I watched your face, you know. You were enjoying my story. You got the fantasy experience of fucking a hot little teenage girl without breaking any laws. And you liked it. You know you liked it. What man wouldn't? But I never laid a finger on her. At least not in that way. I was simply trying to stop her from hurting herself. Finding her friend Candace dead in the cellar affected her oddly, to say the least. I have no idea who murdered oh, her. Oh, cut the crap! You murdered her and you know it! Do I? Do I know that? Do you know that? You found the murder weapon, perhaps. Some tangible piece of evidence that identifies me as her killer. Well... No. Then but... let's leave your petty accusations out of this proceeding, shall we? I'm done indulging in your schoolgirl fantasies. I am dealing with the facts now, and the primary fact is this. There isn't a single shred of evidence against me apart from a hysterical teenage girl's story. Even if I had raped her, there would be no DNA evidence, because I'm a non-secretor. I will trust that a doctor like you knows what that means. What truth was told, I was relieved when the police arrived. After all, I had a hysterical, naked 14-year-old girl on my hands. Sir! I want you to step away from that girl, right now. And I certainly harbor no ill feelings for the misunderstanding what they saw. I'm sure I would have thought the same thing myself under the circumstances. Step away from her now. Thank God you're here. Uh, this poor girl needs our help. Step away from the girl. You don't understand. I'm her doctor, and she is a danger to herself and others. You've got to help me get her to the psych ward at the hospital. Step away! Now! All right! Don't shoot me, for God's sake. I, I, I'm just trying to explain to you. And... I want you to lay face down on the ground, arms fully extended. Really? Of all the indignities. Now! God damn it, now! There, there. It's over. You can rest now. I'm so sorry I had to put you through that. Trust me, it will be easier for you at the trial. Trial? Yes.
We can't lock that sick bastard away without a trial. But don't worry about it. Your testimony will be enough to get him the maximum sentence, I'm sure. Testimony? No, I can't. I won't. Jessica! No, don't you understand? I never want to think about what happened again. I'm too ashamed of, of what he did to me. You can't force me to, can you? No, honey. No one can force you to. But do you understand that without your testimony he may not be convicted? God, I don't know what to do. Shall I tell you what happens next? Please. In a few moments, your cell phone will ring. It will be the district attorney telling you to shut everything down. He'll tell you that the girl is not going to testify, and without her, they don't have enough evidence to secure a conviction. I'll be a free man by morning. How can you be so sure she won't testify? Oh, I can't. But statistics say she won't. And even if she does testify, she'll be lying. I'm fairly certain my lawyer will be able to blow holes through any story she cares to fabricate. <laughs> Want me to get that for you? Hello? Y yes, sir. Uh, I, I see. Are you sure? All right, then. Thank you. Goodbye. Well, I guess we're packing it up here. Told you. She's not going to testify, is she? No, she's not. So the DA talked to the judge, and on the basis of the evidence we have... Persuaded him to forego the grand jury and go straight to trial. Evidence? There's no evidence! The DA asked me to compliment you on the quality of your cell phone. It seems your girlfriend was talking to 911 when you caught up to her and they got the whole thing on tape. You're lying. My cell phone doesn't work from the cabin. I know. I've tried. Nah, but you weren't at the cabin, were you? You were chasing her through the woods and, apparently, right into an active cell. Are you ready to rock and roll, Mr. McAvoy? Because you'll get plenty of that where you're going. No! All right, let's pack it up, boys. It's Miller time. No, I I'm not done yet. You haven't finished your job, damn it! Put that camera back. Put that cam. Let us pray for the loss of our daughter, our sister, our friend. Candace Brayton, let us bow our heads. Jessica. Are you ready to rock and roll? <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 